A heated public disagreement has erupted between billionaire Elon Musk and British Prime Minister Keir Starmer, following Musk's controversial remarks on social media suggesting that the UK is on the brink of civil unrest. These remarks, made on his Platform X, were in response to a video showing demonstrators launching fireworks at police officers, where Musk claimed that civil unrest is inevitable. This sparked widespread concern, with many fearing that online misinformation is worsening the already tense situation. The Prime Minister's spokesperson quickly condemned Musk's comments, stating that there is no justification for such alarmist remarks. However, the situation intensified when Musk replied to a post from Keir Starmer, who had denounced the violence against Muslims. Musk provocatively suggested that Starmer should consider all communities amidst the turmoil. This exchange only heightened public attention on the ongoing events. Prime Minister Starmer has been actively coordinating the government's response to the far-right disturbances spreading across the country. He convened an emergency COBRA meeting with ministers and law enforcement officials to address what he described as senseless violence. In a decisive move, Starmer announced the deployment of a dedicated force of specialist officers to manage the situation. He emphasized that the justice system would be fast-tracked with many arrests already made and underscored that the law applies online as well, stating that anyone found to have committed a criminal offense online can expect the same response as those directly participating on the streets. The ease with which such remarks can go viral has sparked a debate about the responsibility of social media platforms in moderating content and preventing the spread of potentially harmful rhetoric. This issue has added another layer of complexity to an already volatile situation, as both the government and the public grapple with the broader implications of online discourse in times of national crisis. In the midst of this escalating exchange, the role of social media platforms like X has come under scrutiny. Critics argue that Musk's unfiltered commentary exemplifies the dangers of influential figures making incendiary statements online, which can quickly amplify tensions in real-world situations. I made it very clear on a number of occasions that those involved will feel the full force of the law. So we coordinated, we went through some of the numbers, over 400 people now have been arrested, 100 have been charged, some in relation to online activity, and a number of them are already in court. And I'm now expecting substantive sentencing before the end of this week. That should send a very powerful message. The riots initially began in Southport following the arrest of Axel Rudakubana, a 17-year-old British-born suspect for the alleged murder of three young girls at a Taylor Swift-themed dance party and multiple attempted murders. These riots have been fueled by misinformation, particularly the false belief that the stabbing suspect was a Muslim asylum seeker. Over 400 arrests have been made since the riots began reflecting the scale of the unrest. Despite the escalation, the government has dismissed calls for military intervention, asserting that the police have sufficient resources to manage the situation. Reform UK party leader Nigel Farage, however, demanded in a statement on X that Starmer should not rule out military intervention if the situation deteriorates further. Farage also suggested that recalling parliament would be appropriate given the gravity of the circumstances. As the UK continues to grapple with these protests, which have spread across England targeting mosques and hotels housing asylum seekers, the government has had to provide emergency security to Islamic places of worship. Amidst this turmoil, Musk further fueled tensions with a provocative reply to a tweet by Prime Minister Starmer questioning whether the UK was Britain or the Soviet Union. This unfolding drama highlights the broader challenges of managing the impact of social media on real-world events. The rapid spread of misinformation and provocative statements from influential figures like Musk can significantly influence public perception and incite unrest. As the government works to restore order and address the underlying issues, the role of social media in shaping public discourse remains a critical concern. Adding to the complexity of the situation, Musk's comments have drawn international attention, with media outlets worldwide scrutinizing his statements and their potential impact on the UK social fabric. The billionaire's influence on social media, coupled with his unfiltered style, has made his remarks a focal point in the ongoing crisis. His questioning of whether the UK is becoming like the Soviet Union has sparked a broader debate about freedom of speech, the role of social media in modern democracies, and the responsibilities of those with large platforms. 
international reactions have been mixed, with some leaders expressing concern over Musk's statements, fearing they may further destabilize an already volatile situation. Analysts have pointed out that Musk's influence could potentially sway public opinion and incite further unrest, making it imperative for both the UK government and social media platforms to address the dissemination of such provocative content. The European Union has also weighed in with calls for stronger regulations to prevent the spread of misinformation and inflammatory rhetoric online. Meanwhile, public sentiment in the UK is deeply divided. Some citizens support Musk's right to free speech and see his comments as a necessary critique of government actions. Others, however, view his remarks as reckless and harmful, potentially inciting more violence and division. This split in public opinion highlights the broader societal challenges the UK faces in dealing with both the immediate crisis and the longer-term impact of social media on public discourse. As the government continues to respond to the riots and the broader implications of Musk's comments, the focus has also shifted to the role of tech companies in moderating content on their platforms. There is increasing pressure on these companies to take more responsibility for the content they host with suggestions for implementing stricter guidelines and more proactive measures to combat misinformation. This ongoing debate is likely to shape future policies and regulations, not just in the UK, but globally, as governments and tech companies alike grapple with the complexities of the digital age. As the discourse continues, there is growing recognition of the need for a multifaceted approach to address the spread of misinformation and its real-world consequences. Experts suggest that beyond stricter content moderation, educational initiatives aimed at improving digital literacy among the public are crucial. By equipping individuals with the skills to critically evaluate online information, society can build resilience against the manipulation of narratives by malicious actors. This approach underscores the importance of collaboration between governments, tech companies, and educational institutions in fostering a more informed and discerning public. Moreover, the situation has prompted a reevaluation of existing laws and the potential for new legislation tailored to the digital era. Policymakers are exploring the balance between protecting free speech and preventing harmful content that incites violence and division. The debate extends to the role of algorithms and artificial intelligence in amplifying certain types of content, with calls for greater transparency and accountability from tech companies. As the UK navigates these challenges, the outcomes of these discussions and policy decisions could set important precedents for other nations facing similar issues. In conclusion, the public feud between Elon Musk and Prime Minister Keir Starmer underscores the complex interplay between social media, public perception, and real-world events. The riots, fueled by misinformation and exacerbated by provocative statements, have highlighted the urgent need for responsible communication, especially from influential figures. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you never miss an update. We'd love to hear your thoughts on this heated debate. Do you think Elon Musk's comments were justified or do you believe they were out of line? How do you feel about the role of social media in shaping public opinion during such volatile times? Let us know in the comments below.